belong to you And I'll always be around When I need some loving, baby And I'll never let you down Let you down, let you down Where are you? It's the end of the weekend But I still wanna turn up Yeah, I still wanna turn up All I want is to... I don't know if you guys can hear me, but I'm currently heading to school. Today is um, 1st of January, 2022. Happy New Year, guys. Happy New Year. And um, ah, I'm just very grateful for life, to be honest. And I know that God has like big plans this New Year. So um, let me know what you guys think about 2022, uh, what your hopes are, what your dreams are. Just let me know in the comments yeah so this is me facing the sun let me just do a quick intro welcome to another vlog welcome to 2022 um i wish you guys an amazing new year today is quite sunny that's why i wore um these shades i got them from primark in case you're wondering so yeah this is the fit check it's not too cold today that's why i'm wearing a crop top and just joggers and shoes yeah so um yeah i'm going to school now new year it doesn't matter i've been working all week so i have to catch up with school work and work on my assessments yeah so that's what i'm doing today so yeah guys um peace So guys i was wondering why the weather was um was not cold at all apparently it's just 15 degrees so that explains it because bro like if it were to be on christmas day like you guys saw in my previous vlog bro i could i couldn't try this like i couldn't try it at all <laughs> so yeah apparently it's like 15 degrees so i could actually do without this without wearing my coats or Yeah, but I just decided to wear the coats today just in case when I'm coming back because I don't know how many hours I'm going to be spending in the library so just in case I'm coming back and then uh, and um, it gets a bit chill chilly but <laughs> I don't intend to spend too long in the library today because uh, number one the library closes at 10 and then um, I'm leaving by 2 now by the way so I just want to do like I already started reading <coughs> before I came out so I'm more um, I have a direction now that I'm going so yeah um, so almost at school let you guys know when I get there it should be open today it's, the cars here are quite everywhere here is quite noisy so I'll catch you guys later I really do wish the the weather can be like this all through January because like this weather is nice I'm not going to lie like it's really nice like you can wear whatever you want and still get away with it it's cool though 50 degrees is cold but I mean I've been here for a minute so like it's chilled do you understand like it's just it's just calm like I could even wear a gun and still be fine it's not too hot it's not too cold so yeah like i really wish the weather can just be like this because before now it was terrible and that's why it's um it's a bit quiet right now 
but yeah so that that's my school um cathedral yeah so i'm just entering into the main campus at the moment i'm walking to the library as i was saying that's the thing like i've noticed it in chester here I don't know if it's like common to other counties, but here in Chester, like they do a lot of holding of hands, especially older couples, and I feel like that's a nice thing. I mean, that's something I want to do with my husband when we're like old, old, not even when we're young, but when we're old, old, like that intimacy, it's just priceless. So yeah, like it's really admirable. Every time I see um, older couples who hold hands like that, like something I want, in my own marriage. So guys, I just got to the library. Um, the main entrance is not open today because obviously it's a public holiday. So I'm going to use um, an alternative entrance. This is my school, guys. This is the University of Chester. I don't think I've shown you guys before, but yeah, I'm going just going to put clips here and there, showing you guys some uh, bits and pieces of what my school looks like. It's really beautiful and big. I'm looking for the power button. Yeah, so this is where I like to study. Um, I think the screen is a bit dirty. I'll just clean it. So I like studying in this area because of the MacBooks. I'll just get the, one of these. Oopsie. Sorry. Yes, I'll just get that and use it to clean and wipe because it looks a little looks dirty. I don't think they've cleaned this place in a minute. And I'll also just um, disinfect this area and also the mouse pad. Yeah. Um, yeah, I'm here now. My hair is scattered because of the wind. But that was okay because I came prepared. I brought a comb. Um, because I knew that that was going to happen. Just get water. I'm already getting hungry, so I'm nibbling on cashew nuts. I'll just get water so I don't have to stand like so many times. Girl, I see your face everywhere. When I'm going out, you'll be there. This everything reminds me of you. I can't take no more. Girl, I think I'm losing my mind. Try to go to work, but I lost track of time. Everyone keep looking like you I can't take no more I miss your touch From your hands and your body It hurts so much To think of you as someone else Can't get enough When you're sweet talking to me Now I'm talking sweet all by myself Put your arms around me Put your faith in me Put your love on me what I'm working on today is my assessment, like I said. 
So what I'm doing is I've already done a recording. It's a three-step assessment. You do a um, you carry out an online consultation with the client, and then secondly, you do like you write a reflective writing about what how you carried out the consultation, the pros, the cons, where you can work better, and the last one is like developing like an action plan for your client. So um, I've already done the first part. I've recorded it. So I think I'm just going to watch it back again and um, yeah, just basically find articles to back up um, my reflective writing process. So that's what I'm doing today. I have right now, I have two major assignments that I'm working on. So yeah, I'm working on this one first. I want to be done with it by this week. That's the goal. So much to think of you as someone else. Sweet talking to me. Now I'm talking sweet all by myself. Put your arms around me, put your faith in me, put your love on me. So I'm done. What's it called? I'm done watching back on my video. So now I'm just going to start like the writing process. And I have my um my book here. So this is where the research work starts. And um I need to straighten this hair, it's been a while. Anyway, so yeah, like, now is where the um, actual research process right, um, starts. And the this one is 1,000 words for the reflective writing. I mean, it shouldn't take me that long. It's about 3.15 now. I plan to leave here by 4 because I haven't eaten. I just ate food um, like you guys saw today. But I need to cook something. So I might... I might since it's almost fun, I might leave here by five or six. Yeah, by five, I could just wait a bit. I feel quite lightheaded, but I could wait a bit. So yeah, I just want to start the um, actual um, looking at research papers to start reading because um, as much as the reflective writing is about writing about what happened during the consultation, you're still supposed to go back and reference um, evidence-based um, papers to back up everything you've said and how you can do better as a as a consultant. Okay, lovely. Um, is that big enough for your geometry to expand it a bit? Chicken, your fish, right? Am I correct? Yeah, that's very true. Okay, so that's a very positive thing to hear, and I'm very glad that you gave me. I want to use the printer to um, print out a paper that I found interesting so yeah I'm just going to show you guys how I go about that so for the printing in you use your card to print I have um, credits on my card already to print out the school gave me 500 copies free for starting but I know it's going to be over soon because I've printed a lot of papers so, yeah so I just want to um, print out one paper I'm just going to show you guys how it works I think I find it really cool I mean, like here in the UK, you have to learn how to do everything yourself. You have to learn how to use a copier by yourself. So, yeah, I'm just going to show you guys real quick. Ooh la la, beautiful lighting, amazing lighting, so cool. So, now when you come on here, you can see that um, nothing is displaying. So, you need to put in your user ID. So, to do this, there's a barcode um, just there's a barcode just right here. So, this barcode is for almost everything like access in general in school so what you do is that you just place it and then it automatically comes um, so this is my balance left so what i'm going to do is just click this and then the documents that i want to print out is already here so i'm just going to press start so it's printing at the moment and um it just comes out obviously through this point yeah really easy guys like super easy I'm taking time yeah so this is um, I could have expanded it a bit but it's fine yeah so this is what um, I wanted to print out so typically that's how I print out like important papers that I know I want to like go back and study or read or use I like to use them um, I like to use um, papers when I'm doing when I'm when I start typing. So you yeah, any paper that I find like very interesting, I just print it out. 
and type from that paper. So I need to head back now to continue. Hi guys, um, so I'm done for today and I just had this sip of water. I'm actually exhausted and I don't think I can continue anymore so I'm heading home now. Um, I really hope you guys enjoyed like spending time with me and seeing the way I go about planning. planning for my assignments and all that I'm just finding my key card so I'm going home to make dinner I actually don't know what I want to make yet I'll figure it out I was going to make obono today just to mark like near just eat something different but we'll see how that goes when I get home because I'm I'm just going to see if I can still do that. So I really hope you guys enjoyed um, this vlog. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. If you want like more videos of what my life is like being a master's student, just let me know and I'll do so to make more videos and vlogs like this. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Bye. Take me your arms. Do just what you want. You're the one I trust. I belong, I belong to you. And I'll always be around when I need some love and baby. And I'll never let you down. Let you down, let you down. I'm your song. Can you sing all my melodies? There's no one.